here we are at the Australian Computer Museum in Sydney and we're looking at this uh, device. It's a little advertising screen that was originally used, I believe, <coughs> at a JCAR store. So you can see it was set up to advertise uh, something called Little Bits, uh, some sort of electronic construction toy type thing. And in it we've got an LCD screen on the front. In the back here you can see there's a board that runs the whole thing. It runs off a 12 volt plug pack. We've got a little speaker down there. And there is both an SD card slot and a USB slot. It did come with a little one gigabyte SD card but um, it seemed to be corrupted in some way. We couldn't get the files off it. So we're using a USB stick, which seems to work pretty much the same way. So when we turn it on, you can see it lights up. Screen lights up. And then after a few seconds, it will tell us that it can't find the video. So it wants something called uloop.avi. Now, unfortunately, we don't know exactly how uloop.avi was encoded. So I've had to do quite a bit of trial and error. Um, I tried exporting AVIs from Adobe Premiere, tried using VLC to convert a lot of different things. I uh, just didn't seem to work. Um, I did download a very small AVI file just from a file example site, and that played for some reason but I still couldn't seem to replicate it. Eventually, I did find an online converter, this VDIO, and the files that come out of this will play on the device there, as long as they're not too large in, in uh, resolution. So the maximum I was able to get out of it was, uh, I think, about 850 by 480. If I tried going to 720, it doesn't play. But that means, If we now take our USB stick and plug it in, switch it on, okay, it will take a little while to start up. Are you keeping up Here we go. With the the is keeping up with Are you, you keeping up with the Commodore? So I've downloaded some old Australian computer ads. Uh, because of the aspect ratio, I've stuck some bars down the sides there. This thing would obviously be for a 4x3 TV. I'm guessing that the LCD is 1280 by 720, just going off the size and the age of it. But again, I can't actually get a 720p video to go into it. Looking for a TV game? These games are good, but we don't think that. Yeah, so what can we do with this? Well, um, our idea is that all of the branding on it is just stuck on or painted on. So I think we'll take it apart. We want to respray it in the green that we use for the ACMS. We can change these little um, bezels around it to show some other graphics or something. And then we're just going to load it up with a bunch of kind of retro um, Australian video content and we can put this in the front room for when people come in or we could use this at events, that sort of stuff. And yeah, for a, a free device, it's not that bad. Uh, it was very frustrating getting it to work, but now that it is working, um, yeah, I'm hoping that you're gonna be seeing more of it.